everybody. So glad you're with us. Joe Tessitore alongside Teddy Atlas, and we welcome you to Boardwalk Hall and the famed Atlantic City Boardwalk in southern New Jersey. Well, they've been waiting for this moment, and now they get it. Round one underway. Couldn't hit the elusive target with that straight right. And you see what he can do when he sends that right to the head. Well, this is the kind of work, a good solid headshot that won Vladimir Klitschko the heavyweight championship and has kept him on top now for the better part of this decade. Yeah, what I like about it is when he throws the punches, he's always in position to come back with another one. I'm expecting him to start coming back with other ones now. Many of these Vladimir Klitschko title defenses have looked moving. much the same, be it Sultan of Ragamoff or Tony Thompson or Shigayev or Eddie Chambers. It all follows the same script. Yeah, well, he controls range. He understands, you know, he reminds me of Clint Eastwood a little bit in the Dirty Harry movies where he says a man must know his limitations. You know, he understands his strengths, but he knows his limitations. He's not an inside fighter. He doesn't deal with pressure on the inside, so he keeps you on the outside. He uses that long range. He uses that jab to control you, and then he looks to hit you with the right hand. He lets you take the chances, and then he looks to catch you coming in. Accurate hook. Good defense upstairs to stay away from that offensive assault. Good work defensively by Vladimir Klitschko. Plus, he landed that counter punch. Yeah, and he forced him to punch. He made him, he drew it out of him, and then he timed him beautifully. They're not exactly getting to know each other. They're just beating the hell out of each other early on here. Yeah, Joe, this keeps up. They're both going to have headaches, and we're going to have one of the great fights to talk about. Look at that combination by Mike Tyson. Solid straight right hand. End of the round here. You can see the fans really enjoying themselves tonight. You know, Teddy, I think maybe more so than any other sport, boxing fans are not just passionate like in other sports, but they are smart and savvy. They know the game inside and out. Well, they follow the contestants. They do understand the parameters of the game. And you know what? They come here and they kind of demand from those fighters the performance that they expect from them. They expect the guy to box. You hear them every once in a while saying, hey, come on, you know, let's get that champ working. They act like coaches sometimes. Iron Mike with a big uppercut. Solid counter punch by Mike Tyson. Hook up the jazz. Combination punch by Vladimir Klitschko. That has to be concerning if you're in the other corner. And coming upon the halfway mark of this three-minute round. Tyson's inconsistencies are really showing up now. At times, he has shown defense tonight. Other times, with what we've seen recently, he's getting hit by the left hand. Yeah, what he has to do is now make the adjustment. He missed with that headshot. Come on, get focused. Nice work blocking that, and then an uppercut of his own. And now he brings the left hand upstairs. Good fighting, snapping shot by Vladimir Klitschko. Everybody knows Vladimir Klitschko wants to do that right there. The jab, the straight, typically the win. He digs in with a left hand to the body. And we come to the end of round number two. One more Tyson's has to prove that he's a deep stretch runner here right now. I think he's slightly trailing as this fight comes to the later stages. But you can see his corner imploring him to go out and win it. Rushing uppercut by Vladimir Klitschko. Vladimir Klitschko's right hand did a nice job that time. That worked well for him. 
Teddy, I think the fans sometimes don't appreciate it, but what he's doing right now on the outside is very smart. Well, this is a sweet science, Joe, and that's exactly what he's doing. He's understanding where he needs to be and he's controlling that dimension. Flush right hand to the body. Little head hunting with the left. Just a minute and a half left in the fight. He tried to nab him up top, but was unable to connect. The script for Vladimir Klitschko is always the same. Trying to target the right hand, he hit the target that time. A minute to go in the fight. A little give and take, and here comes the left hand. Oh, and he got caught right there. Everything was going fine, and then he got caught. Well, that's the problem. It was going too fine. He got a full sense of security. The other guy wasn't throwing back. He took for granted, and bang, you can't take for granted in this ring. Good doubling up of the jab by Mike Tyson. Keep those hands up. Oh. He comes with the straight right hand. So you can put that one into the books. As for the judges' scorecards, let's send it up to the ring for the official.